This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. Health experts believe the Delta variant could be weeks away from becoming the most dominant strain in the country. It's already causing concerns just to our north in L.A. County, where officials are recommending the use of face masks. For now, here in San Diego County, Nathan Fletcher says they are monitoring things closely but not changing the guidance. Experts say this variant is far more contagious. However, people who are fully vaccinated are protected against this variant. The battle to stop the 4th of July fireworks show because of concerns about sea lions in La Jolla continues. Today, a judge listened to arguments on both sides. The Animal Protection and Rescue League says the fireworks will harm newborn sea lion pups and the environment. Attorneys for the fireworks explain that this is an event funded by the community that's been happening for the last three decades. Judge says he won't make a decision just yet, but time is of the essence with the holiday just five days away. First trolley cars uh, glided along the tracks of the mid-coast extension of the UC San Diego Blue Line this morning. The extension won't be in operation until November, but today marks the beginning of the train testing phase of the project, as well as the official transfer of responsibility from Sandag to MTS. That extension of the Blue Line will serve points from downtown all the way north to UC San Diego. Construction began in 2016. The new Tecolote station is one of the new stops. All right, let's get out to Megan now, get a check on our weather today. Are we going to lose these clouds at any point today? Well, some areas are going to be stuck in the clouds even into the afternoon, and areas that do clear out of the marine layer are actually going to see monsoon clouds coming in. So today is definitely going to be a cloudier day than it was yesterday, for at least most of the county. Some areas yesterday were actually stuck in that June plume all day. Quite a bit cooler as well. We'll be in the 70s for most coast and inland neighborhoods. Some inland neighborhoods, though, like Ramona, Alpine, Escondido, and Poway, will climb into the 80s today. 80s in the mountains with about temperatures at about 107 in the deserts. It will be more humid today as monsoon moisture surges in, bringing with it a chance for showers and thunderstorms this afternoon and evening. Best chance will be near the mountain and desert areas, though it's not out of the question that one or two of those could move into the inland valleys and a very slim chance that we could even see a, see a few sprinkles all the way to the coastline. And best chance for showers and thunderstorm activity this week will be tomorrow, decreasing chances on Thursday, and it will be less humid just in time for the 4th of July weekend. Jim? All right, very good timing. Megan, thank you so much. For the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News mobile app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.